The All-Star break came at the perfect time for the New York Knicks because, boy, were they struggling over the past week heading into the break. Will it fix their problems? And also, did the 76ers get a chance to fix their problems without Embiid? I'm going to break this game down for you and tell you the best way to play this game and make some money. It's actually with the over-under, in my opinion. And that's coming up free for you here in just a moment. Hi, this is Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, back here on Wager Talk TV. And we're looking at the first game on the board. 12 games in the NBA back out of the break here. We're looking at one of the first games on the board at 7 o'clock Eastern tonight on Thursday between the Knicks and 76ers in Philadelphia. As we check the Wager Talk live odd screen Thursday afternoon, we see that Philly opened as a one-point favorite, and it's held steady, very little movement on the side. Total, though, has gone from 226.5 up to 229, and I actually disagree with that move. I think the under is the way to play this game, and there's a few reasons why. First of all, I referenced how the Knicks went ice cold. This is a team after the two-for-one trade with Toronto who was playing excellent basketball throughout January. And then, boy, when the February turned, things turned. This team had won nine straight and gone eight and one against the spread into the first day of February. And since then, they've gone one and five straight up, 0 and six against the spread. They have not covered the spread for the past three weeks. So, yes, the All Star break came at the perfect time for the Knicks. And the problem wasn't that their offense got weaker, it did, but their defense got a lot worse. During that nine game win streak, um, they held every single opponent to 46% shooting or less. And during this 1-5 in five slide, they have allowed 45% or worse in all six games. In fact, they've allowed five of the last six opponents during this 1-5 in five straight up slide to shoot 49% or higher. So it's been night and day on the defensive end for the Knicks. And this is a team that was on a huge under run. In fact, uh, they'd gone under 11 out of 12 straight. And then they went over it for their last five heading into the break. I think the week off, the focus is going to be on defense. And I think the Knicks come to play defensively tonight. And I think Philadelphia will as well. The Sixers have obviously struggled without Joel Embiid, but they did win two of their final three games before the break, including a nice upset win at Cleveland, then lost to Miami at home. Defense was much better, though. They gave up 54%, actually about 52% shooting or worse. Well, let's be exact, 50% or worse in six of seven games. And then those last three games before the break, 48, 48, and 48% allowed in all three. So their defense got better. I think that's how they're going to continue to play until Embiid comes back in the next month or two. The Knicks will definitely focus on it. Could be a little bit of a sneaky under here. I don't agree with that move higher. Take under 229 if you're looking to play this game between the Knicks and Sixers tonight at 7 Eastern on Thursday. Now, I passed it out of the NBA. It's always a little dicey after the NBA All-Star break how teams come out. But I do have one top opinion for you. I posted that for free between the Lakers and Warriors, one of your late Thursday night games at 10 Eastern. That's on my page right now, free for everybody at wagertalk.com, but the best deal tonight is my college basketball steamroller best bet. Not only is it a strong best bet, by the way, I'm ranked number one in college and pro basketball units, one on all sides going back to the start of the season in October this year at Wager Talk. but more importantly, it's half price Thursday customer appreciation, which means you get an instant 50% discount. So instead of 25, you get this top play tonight for just $12, and it's a fantastic play. It's my strongest best bet on the board. I'm up 23 games above 500 on all basketball sides. I'm going to add to it tonight with a college basketball steamroller. Strong best bet plus that bonus NBA play for free. Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Get there quicker with shortcut wt.buzz slash sm. Also, when you're on the page, check out the weekly and full year special promo codes this week. If you want to try the week of service, you get an instant 25% discount. Or if you're ready to take the serious investment approach, I brought back my one-year special, which I offered last month. It's an instant $800 discount. Works out to just over $3 a day, just over a dollar a play for every football, baseball, and basketball, side and total, everything for the next 365 days and nights. Now is the time to lock up a full year of best bets from the number one ranked capper, all sports, over the past two years plus at Wager Talk. So far in 2024, I mentioned that number one ranking in basketball, but all sports, football and basketball so far this year, number one on all sides combined. And that's not a surprise. The last two years, 2022 and 2023, nobody won more units of profit in football, baseball and basketball, all sports sides combined than I did at wagertalk.com. So what a great time right now to save $800 and lock up a full year, 365 days and nights for just over a dollar a play with that all access special. Now, if you want to try a smaller package, I made a one-week sampler available as well with an instant 25% discount. Or if you want just tonight's play, it's a great time to do it. It's a strong college best bet, and you get it for half price with Customer Appreciation Thursday, along with that bonus free NBA play for everyone on my page, Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Get there quicker with shortcut wt.buzz slash sm. Follow me on Twitter and X as well for free information, at Steve Merrill on Twitter, 2Rs1L, at Steve Merrill. 
Also post free information and plays on Instagram. Follow me on IG. And comment below here on YouTube. I read all the comments. I reply back. Who do you like tonight in the NBA? There's eight. Uh, there's 12 games on the board. 11 other games to talk about. And by the way, I'm doing the NBA tip-off show today on Thursday. So check that out here on NBA TV and on the replay here on YouTube for all your NBA information. Comment below, though. I read all the comments. I reply back. Thumbs up, like, if you found this free video useful. And don't forget, hit subscribe and hit the bell for instant alerts so you know when these free plays go up each and every day throughout the week. And when my college basketball top 25 video for Saturday's big games is available on Friday night. So like, subscribe, and hit the bell for instant alerts. And stay tuned right here on Wager Talk TV for more great college and pro basketball preview videos coming up next.